And how are you doing today, guys? Look, what happened? He met my expectations. He bought the second color changing bag. How is that? How good does it feel like knowing your sacrifice and the expectations you had for that sacrifice came through for you? How does that feel? Feels great. Tell you what. So, you know, spoke to that. We saw that. And when I saw that, I also heard about uh, this diamond, this race car driver. Hopefully he actually knows how to drive and, and uh, stuff like this. And uh, then I found out about him. He, the, the thing he's had a hard on forever for is uh, his, uh, his ability to be able to have a discussion with Peter Schiff. Peter Schiff is this mouthpiece for all the gold bugs out there. Peter Schiff uh, sells, like, you call him up, I try to buy gold once off him, find out how they do it. They take your money and then they go buy it. You're not going to get the best, you're going to pay high premiums. It's, it's, he's a broker, man. Peter Schiff pays taxes. And uh, it's just a mouthpiece for, you know, maybe his father. I think, hopefully, it would be really good if Richard took into consideration um, Irwin Schiff. And the fact that what Irwin Schiff did and, and how he lived until his end days in jail for, like, what was accused of evading taxes, um, which I'm sure something Richard truly um, is close to the concept of and the desire for is, uh, uh, you know, taxation with representation or without it is not something he's very uh, keen on. He's obviously, you know, spent a lot of energy avoiding criminals and people that steal from you and then on the other end of the coke and you go you got peter schiff who uh uh his father died for that cause and peter speaks to that cause um as a mouthpiece but he definitely is somebody who's paying taxes he's a he's a you know peter schiff here for what it's worth have another right here you know where his money is this is where his money is kent and dunhill apparently they pay 75 cents per share uh dividend which is about eight and a half percent or eight something percent i don't fucking know but that's where Peter Schiff's money is. Um, so, you know, what I would really wonder if the capacity of these people would speak to those of us that believe in truth, justice, and the American way, um, I, I would like to think that maybe they could come together and see eye to eye and maybe, maybe fucking uh, Peter could give Richard some gold and let Richard speak to the concept of gold and the benefits thereof and maybe... Uh, Peter wouldn't uh, have to like go and destroy uh, 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 Richard wouldn't have to go destroy Peter um, based on how smart everything is because of price you know that's the only argument truly anything holds these days as far as what uh, uh, makes you smart is the price of something yeah doesn't really hold any value to like so many of the core things and the whole story behind it all you know it's ultimately, I'm right, you're wrong. Let's divide each other so we can have some fucking cut on top telling us who's going to be the arbiter, who's going to be the regulator, who's going to be in control. Are you going to speak to, like, how, how we can, you know, remove ourselves from that, Richard? How about you, Peter? Do you think any of these idiots are going to listen to this shit? <laughs> Dude! You fucking bought it! <laughs>